The top 10 shortstops in Major League history. At 10, I've got Alan Trammell. Four gold gloves and probably should have won MVP in 1987. At nine, I've got Archie Vaughn. A nine-time All-Star who finished with a career on base percentage of 406. At eight, I've got Robin Young. Had over a 10 more during his 1982 MVP season and 3,000 career hits. At seven, I've got Barry Larkin. Won three gold gloves and an MVP during his career. At six, I've got Ozzie Smith. Greatest defensive shortstop ever. If he did more on offense, he'd be even higher. At five, I've got Ernie Banks. 500 home runs and two MVP awards. At four, I've got Derek Jeter. The most hits of any shortstop in Major League history. Was also a part of five World Series winning teams. At three, I've got Cal Ripken Jr. He had 3,000 hits, two MVPs, and two 10 war seasons. At number two, I've got Alex Rodriguez. He would be my number one if he didn't switch to third base partway through his career. Before he became a third baseman for the Yankees, his career triple slash line as a shortstop was 308, 382, 581. He also won an MVP and two gold gloves. At one, I've got Hannes Wagner. He finished his career with a 328 lifetime batting average, including eight batting titles. He also stole 723 